A fast-moving fire destroyed two houseboats overnight in Clark County. We have just learned that investigators have ruled out arson as the cause. The fire was reported late last night at Cadow's Marina. Today, Brent Weisberg is digging deeper into marina fire safety. There are about 90 different marinas, all varying in size, under the jurisdiction of Portland Fire Harbor Master Ray Pratt. From the flotation, from the float up, they're built just like every other house. Today, I learned that there have been no major marina fires in Portland since 2006. The city credits that to its aggressive fire regulations. When it comes to fire code in Portland, moorages are required to make sure that there's good access for fire trucks. The docks themselves have to be at least six feet wide, steady, and clear of debris. If the docks cluttered or are too narrow, we're going to be bumping into each other, knocking somebody off the dock. Then we've got a rescue situation instead of just a fire situation. When it comes to the spacing between the homes on the water, that up until 1990 was pretty much unregulated, and in some cases, houseboats were actually touching. Now, new houseboats have to be 10 feet apart, wall to wall. It's real common to lose the uh, house that starts fire and the two next to it if they're too close. Pratt tells me that marina fires can spread fast once you factor in all the wood, combustibles, and the wind that is often blowing on the rivers. I've also learned that Portland marinas have hookups like these for instant water access. Fire Marshal in Clark County tells me that in last night's boat fire, the marina doesn't have any hydrants, so it was difficult to run hoses. Pratt says that firefighters do site visits to make sure that maps are updated and equipment like the water pipes themselves are working. Reporting in downtown Portland, I'm Brent Weisberg, Coin 6 News.